Tijuana breakfast burrito. And I really need to make some and get some in my freezer. This Kentucky Legend ham, you saw me make a sandwich the other day out of it. I'm gonna chop some of it up and put it in a few burritos. That was so good. Bacon in my refrigerator. I'm gonna fry some up, maybe. I'm not gonna put all of it in the breakfast burrito. I've got some mozzarella cheese that I really need to shred up and use. I really like cheddar, but you know what? I'm using what I've got. to 350 degrees, 10 eggs here. I'm gonna go ahead and pour my frozen spinach in. Okay, I'm pouring this into a greased casserole dish. Salt and pepper. I'm gonna go ahead and put some of this cheese on my casserole. I love cooking in a cast iron pan. Then a little bit of avocado oil. Pepper. I'm gonna put these hash browns in. I love potatoes. I'll put the potatoes in with my peppers and onions, bake them in the oven. And the reason I bake it is just so much easier. You open up this bacon. putting this bacon in a pan. So I like to put a little bit of pepper on my bacon. Nothing fancy, just gonna put it in the oven. So this is my ham. Okay, I'm gonna check on my potatoes. Oh yes. There's my egg casserole. Oh my goodness, spinach cheese, eggs. You can just eat this by itself. That'd be delicious. You know, low carb. Fixing to put those on broil on the top so they will get brown and crispy. And it's crisp enough. It's looking good. So I am going to put this onto a wire rack so it will get all crispy. That's beautiful just by itself. I forgot to put my melted butter on top of my hash browns. Back in Make sure you keep an eye on your oven at 550. It's broiled. That butter on top. Oh my gosh, this pan is so hot. Look at those hash browns. Oh my goodness. It is really hot right now in my kitchen. And I think I might have to change my shirt. Okay, so I got my shirt changed. Taking wax paper and I'm gonna get eight sheets. I love this salsa from Sands. I'm gonna use these tortillas first. You know, you can scramble the eggs, but it is just so much more simpler when you do it like this. You take a little bit of your hash browns, put it on top, a little bit of salsa, as much as you like, and a little bit of cheese on top so when, whenever you go to melt it, it will stick. This comes out really clean, and it's really good. It's not too dry. Put my hash browns on top. Also, the cheese. So I got eight breakfast burritos. I'm going to let these cool. These are going in the freezer. I'm gonna put them in a baggie, a little bit left over, and that's gonna be my breakfast. I'm just gonna eat mine plain. It just looks so good. That's what my egg looks like. It's not overdone.